The U.S. Army is set to deploy its newly developed mid-range capability, MRC Long-Range Launcher, known as Typhoon, in the Indo-Pacific region next year, as revealed by a four-star general. The land-based system is designed to launch Raytheon's ESMA missiles and Tomahawk cruise missiles, covering the range between the Precision Strike Missiles PRSM planned 500-kilometer reach and the future long-range hypersonic weapons. I'll reach up a 2,776-kilometer capability. General Charles Flynn, the U.S. Army Pacific Commander, confirmed successful testing of Typhon and announced plans to deploy the system in the region in 2024 without specifying the exact location. While details about a potential agreement with a foreign government or deployment in Guam were not disclosed, Flynn ruled out placing Typhon on the continental U.S., eliminating the West Coast as an option. The deployment of Typhon marks a significant achievement for the Army, emphasizing its commitment to expanding the precision fire's reach. Flynn envisions a trio of long-range strike options in the region, with the PRSM being another key component. Lockheed Martin is developing PRSM for the M High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, HIMARS, and the MA Multiple Launch Rocket System, NLRs. The Army reported successful short-range tests of PRSM at White Sands Missile Range in New Mexico bringing it closer to fielding the munition. While the initial results were positive, a final flight test report is expected in December 2023, and the service could begin accepting early operational capability missiles by the end of that month. Flynn expressed optimism about deploying PRSM in the Indo-Pacific without requiring specific foreign government permission, as long as they had previously approved the use of HIMARS. He highlighted the versatility of the missile as a compatible component for the existing HIMARS systems. Although the LRHW's operational target has been delayed due to a failed test in October, Flynn did not provide a timeline for its deployment. Despite potential uncertainties about PRSM meeting its 500 kilometers range goal, Flynn expressed satisfaction with any percentage of the solution. Thank you.